That's where the Kentucky House has unanimously voted to pass a flood relief bill for eastern Kentucky. Now it's the Senate's turn to vote on the bill. LEX 18's Evelyn Schultz joins us now with more. Dia, good afternoon. About 40 minutes ago, the Kentucky House broke out into applause after it unanimously voted yes on flood relief for eastern Kentucky. Now the bill is in the hands of the Senate, but everyone is expecting a similar outcome there as well. You might have noticed we might have just had a power surge. Back to the story. This means lawmakers are very close to sending millions of dollars to eastern Kentucky. The bill they've come up with currently stands at $212 million, but there was a last minute effort by an eastern Kentucky lawmaker to put more money in there for private housing. It doesn't appear that effort will hold up. No matter how much money would have been in this bill, it simply would not have been enough. Lawmakers say they know this. They're treating this relief package like a band-aid. It's meant to just get Eastern Kentucky through the next few months. More cash will be needed down the line, but that price tag is still unknown because of all the damage that has not yet been assessed. As soon as the bill passes out of the Senate today, it will immediately be sent to the governor's desk. The governor is expected to sign it. Once he does that, millions should be available for Eastern Kentucky within days. Dia, back to you.